adventure. Here's romance. Here's O. Henry's famous Robin Hood of the Old West, the Cisco Kid. Maybe a few strays hanging out there. What's up, boss? Look at it. Smell it. It's oil. Black gold. Smells like oil. But how do you know? How do I know? Here. I'll prove it to you. Oil, all right. <laughs> I'll write in and tell my niece Peggy. She'll be plum flabbergasted. Yeah. Somebody may be in trouble. She's got somebody that's always in trouble. But why do we have to put our foot where trouble always kicks us in the end? Hey, Pancho, where are you going? The shot came from that way. Yeah, that's why I'm going this way. After him, Pancho. See who this man is. Burton Williams, owner of Circle J Ranch. In case of accident, notify niece Peggy Williams, Circle J Wahoo, Texas. That won't be necessary. I'm his niece. Get your hands up quick. Who, me? Yes, you. All right, I never argue with a pretty girl. Anything you say. And you too. Well, go ahead, Pancho. Do what the lady says. Well, you? Yes. For uh her? -huh. No. What happened, Miss Peggy? These men killed Uncle Bert. Get their guns, Hank. But you're wrong, miss. We didn't kill this man. We were passing by here when we found him lying down here. Look after him, Hank. I'm taking these two into the sheriff. Get on your horses. Would you mind pointing that gun somewhere else? It might go off. 
Yes, it might. Get on your horses. All right, Pancho, get on your horse. Nice day, ain't it? Is it? You bet it is. I'm gonna let you in on a deal that'll make us a million. Yeah? Yeah. There's oil on the Williams Ranch. Well, sounds interesting. Anybody else know about him? Nobody but Williams and me. And he's dead. A couple of strangers shot him. You know, Hank, you're smarter than I thought you were. And uh, still pretty handy with the trigger, eh? I said a couple of strangers shot him. All right, we won't quibble about the details. What's the deal? Well, this is the way I've got it figured out. You put up the money and buy the ranch. We'll split 50-50. Well, that sounds fair enough. I'll have a talk with William's niece right after the funeral. Good. But don't get any ideas of double-crossing me. Why, Hank, you know I wouldn't do that. Just the same. If anything should happen to me, the sheriff will get a letter that'll put a rope right around your neck. Nothing's going to happen to you. You know, Pancho, I've been thinking about this man who came up after the girl took our guns. You think he shot the ranchero? Could be. Then what we are waiting for? Let's go catch him and kill him dead. <laughs> <laughs> well, that, that was a good idea. It's still a good idea, Pancho. How'd you make out? Not so good. She wouldn't sell. But she'll sell before I get through with her. Come on. I'm sending both of you to Baxter Springs, to the U.S. Marshal there. Why, Sheriff? Afraid you'll break out of it? No, Cisco. Maybe he don't like our company. Well, then we'll not impose on him any longer, Pancho. Goodbye, Sheriff. Smart Alex, eh? Put the handcuffs on him. I always wanted to see Baxter Springs. I hear it's very pretty. Hey, what do you say, Pancho? Well, let's win. Handcuff him to the rig, too. All right. Come on. Just got an idea how to make that Williams girl sell. Go after that wagon and make sure that Cisco and Pancho escape. Escape? I don't get it. You will. I'm going after the girl, but I want the sheriff to think that Cisco and Pancho grabbed her. I'll see you at the shack. We'll return in just a moment with the climax of our exciting adventure of the Cisco Kid.
the good thing about these keys, now we can went and hide where the sheriff don't find us, eh? You're wrong. We're going back to town. Hey, don't talk about the town. Every time I think about the town, I think about the jail. When I think about the jail, I think about a rope, and then my neck gets all full of geese pimples. You know, Cisco, the further away you are from you, the better I am. Hey, come back here. Where do you think you're going? Get in there. Well, go on. Oh, Sheriff. Sheriff! She's cool. He ain't here. Now we don't have to wait. Let's wait, eh? Not so fast, Pancho. Your gun, Pancho. Cisco, why are you writing this letter? To let the sheriff know what happened and to tell him we're going over to Circle J to talk to Miss Williams, not Colonel Hank. Oh, no, Cisco, you make a big mistake. No sheriff. We don't want the sheriff to know who we are. Cisco, you make a, a big mistake. No. Pancho, will you be quiet? No. Sheriff. There. Come on, Pancho. No sheriff is going to get this letter. Come on, Pancho. He coming, Cisco. And what were you doing in there so long? Me? Oh, you mean me? Well, can I help it if I don't get around as fast as I used to? Let's get our horses and went. But where are we going to look for them? They could be at that barn over there. There they are. Oh, oh, look, did they put you in jail, eh? Francisco? That's what I'd like to know, Pancho. Look around outside. What's the meaning of this, Stuart? Well, I tried to be a gentleman and buy your ranch, but you didn't like that, so now I'm going to make you sell. You can't make me do anything. No? No. No matter what you do, I'll never sign a deed. Well, maybe a few days without food and water will make you change your mind. Why are you so interested in getting the Circle J anyway? Well, that, my dear girl, is none of your business. Ain't nobody here, Cisco. Hide the horses, Pancho. for you. Go ahead and draw your pistola. There's nothing I would like better than to blow your head off. 
Where is Miss Williams? I don't know. Does he know nothing and something? He knows something, Pancho. He knows who killed Williams, don't you? Maybe his tongue is tangled up in his mouth. I will untangle it for him. Go ahead and shoot. I don't know anything. We'll take him to the sheriff, Pancho. I think he'll talk then. Go on. Uh, under. I think we'd better give the horses a drink. Hey, Pancho, come over here, alone. Hey, you try to get away and you'll, you know where your neck is? You'll be in trouble up to it. What it is? That's why Williams was killed. Oil. Oil? Is that good or bad? Never mind, Pancho. Let him go. He'll lead us to the girl. Sheriff's still shooting at us. That's what makes sheriff sheriffs. They're always shooting at somebody. There is our man again. Have you changed your mind yet? You're wasting your time. What happened? Comes out of my hands. This one is pal after me. I hope they killed both of you. You think they'll trail you here? Yeah, we better make tracks fast. I got a better idea. Shoot him down, Walt. Because my way will make it look like an accident. But the girl, we can't kill her. Why not? We need her to sign the deed, don't we? I'll take care of that. With the girl out of the way, I'll forge her signature. Say, 
That's not bad. If she ain't around, she can't prove she didn't sign it. Exactly. Are you all right, Miss Williams? Yes. Thanks, Cisco. Have you any idea where they went? No. Listen, Cisco. Snakes. Snakes, nothing. That's a fuse burning. Get out of here, both of you. with you at last, Cisco. You caught the wrong man, Sheriff. What do you mean? He's the man who killed my Uncle Bert. He was trying to force me to sell the Circle J. And I'll tell you why. There is oil in your property, lots of it. Poncho and I saw it. This man committed murder to get it. Oh, I didn't do the shooting. Hank did it. You'll have to go someplace where it's awful hot, mister, to prove that. Hank will blow himself up with his own dynamite. Bert, you're under arrest as an accomplice in the murder of Bert Williams. Bill, take him away. Just a minute, Sheriff. Would you mind telling me why you shot at us after you got my note? Note? What note? Hijo de la China Poblana! What's the matter, Pancho? Don't you feel well? Hey, what have you got there? That's the note you write to the sheriff. Pancho! Oh, well, didn't you always tell me to never let the sheriff know what my right hand was doing? What do you mean? Iggy, yeah. I beg you, partner. Hey, Pancho! Where are you going? I'm going with the rainbow sheriffs. <laughs> <laughs> the Cisco Kid will be back in a moment. But first, an important message. <laughs> We'll be back soon. Look for us. <laughs> <laughs>